Hello, I just need to make a little precursor to this video. I am, um, yeah, it was the end of a very busy weekend and I made quite a few mistakes on this interview. Uh, first was getting the wrong Sarah. Hello, Nathan Squires with the Dog Log here and I have a fantastic guest at Woof 2017. It's Sarah Fisher. Sarah Whitehead. <laughs> Idioto. And then that kind of flustered me and I forgot some of the questions that I was going to ask Sarah Whitehead. Um, so hopefully in the future I'll get another chance to talk to her uh, and put that embarrassing moment behind me. Right, without any further ado, enjoy! Hello, it's Nathan Squires with The Dog Log. I'm here with Sarah Whitehead at Woof 2017. Sarah, how are you? I am very well. A little jaded, I have to say, after kind of three days of cramming my hard drive full of amazing information. It has been a fantastic weekend, but um, what are some of the, the, the big moments that you've taken away from it? And, and how did you enjoy presenting? You know, how oh, was that? I loved presenting. It was actually such an honor to you know, be on stage and to talk about things that I'm so passionate about. A bit of myth busting about dog body language, facial expression and perhaps some of the accepted sort of things that we all talk about play bows and puppy biting without actually questioning what they might really be about yeah. Um, but yeah the, the rest of the speakers have just blown me away I'm going going home with so many different ideas and um, and inspired to do more cat training yeah yeah definitely there was definitely a lot of um, it wasn't just dogs at this wolf it really was quite across the board all animals and and you getting a, some of it it's getting a taste about the depth of knowledge is just impressive. Uh, would you come back to Woof 2019? And what what could you ex what could we expect from you in the future? Not just at Woof. Yeah, well, I've already got 2019 in the diary. It's booked out. Fine. So yeah, that's absolutely confirmed. And um, in the in the future, I've got a couple of really exciting things coming out. Uh, the first one is that uh, within the next three weeks, I've got a new program co coming out called 21 Days to a Clever Dog. It's out now, actually. And that was designed for dogs that actually have behavioural problems. So it's a training programme online, little bite-sized mini lessons to just get people started and rebuild their relationship with their dog. And for those that don't know where that is, where can we find that? That's going to be online and it's called 21 Days to a Clever Dog Challenge. And at all good Google shops near you. Excellent. Sarah, thank you so much and uh, we'll, see you, we'll see you soon. Thank you.